and here I am in Phoenix, Arizona. I've been here for over a week. I've been here a lot longer than I thought I was going to be because it is one of the most amazing places you ever want to visit. The people, the food, just everything. Um, let's take a quick look. Wow, you can see some of that. That is the middle of summer, it's damn hot. What am I gonna do for the rest of the today? I could talk about my haircut, but I'm not gonna talk about my haircut. I could talk about my haircut. I'm gonna talk about the guy who cut it. Quinn Austin, one of the coolest guys I've met. Quinn Austin, what a cool name is that for such a cool guy. Quinn grew up on a reservation. He was an amazing artist and amazing basketball player. He, went, he left the reservation and did really well for himself. And a few years ago, he went back to the reservation. He wanted to remind himself of where he was from. And when he got there, he wanted to do something. He wanted to do something for his family, for the people, for his tribe. Right, as I said, he's a, a great artist and a great basketball player. So he went down to the basketball court where he played as a kid. It was run down, it was in a ruin, no one had, had given it much love. So he decides to turn the basketball court into a work of art. He buys some paint, he sits about in the hot sun, repainting the basketball court, turning it into a work of art. People come out and see what he's doing. They're intrigued. They join in. Now he's decided he's going to move back to the place he grew up. He's going to take his family. He's going to turn every basketball court he sees into a work of art. He wants people to be proud of where they're coming from. What he wants to do is to make a reservation, not a place where people feel captured, but a place where people want to go to. And by creating these wonderful works of art, he's creating a destination. And by creating a destination, he's creating pride. So here he is, on his way to do something amazing. Um, anyone can join in. So I'm gonna find out the next time he's painting a basketball court, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna paint a little bit. I may not be the best artist, but I think he'll be able to point me in the right direction. I can do some block colors. So Phoenix, thanks for the haircut and thanks for introducing me to Quinn Austin, one of the coolest guys I've met. What am I going to do for the rest of the today? Well, today is my last day in Phoenix. It's been a blast. Where should I go next? I might just go see the cheapest airfare to the next state and let that be the decision maker. Hmm. Let's see what happens. Mm -hmm.